today's video is going to be a bit different. Today was the day we got a little old mustn't grumble pulled out of water. And I had to sort of like sail it onto the back of this trailer and that was the scariest thing I think I've ever, ever had to do. I had to try and line it up between these posts badly. Ended up whacking one of the posts and had to be pushed in. And um, yeah, this was just, uh, it was it was one of the strangest experiences I've ever had on a boat. And they said like, you know, power it on to get right the way forward like. And um, yeah, whew. So this is the uh, footage taken by Charlotte. I've had to edit out all of Charlotte because um, excellent nautical uh, expert as she is, uh, she was rather critical of my getting it onto the back of this trailer. And I'll fully admit it was not, um, it was not my proudest moment, but scary. And I did get it on. So, this is the bit at the back now where I've got to just wiggle it around just to try and get it between those those two scaffy poles at the back. What an absolute um, bugger of a, a, a sort of manoeuvre that actually was, taking 26 tonnes, 54 foot long, and trying to squeeze it onto the back of a, of a little trailer. This is now where Wilf, big Wilf, yanks me off and... Uh, this was, um, again, completely uh, just a, a, such a weird experience of being on a boat coming out of the water. Uh, I, could, I could now cut to the bit where I'm starting to be pulled out. Uh, but I'm going to carry on talking because you don't want to hear what Charlotte was saying right now. She was not overly complimentary. Uh, so next time I'm going to make her do it. Or I'm going to make her do something equally as... Uh, yeah, this was weird. So this is where now uh, they said, right, you need to get inside because it's dangerous if you fall off because there's no water to break the fall. Um, I then went inside and started closing all the windows. Very, very bizarre. I sort of kind of in a, in a bit of a strange, not state of shock, but a s state of, wow, I'm not sure what this is. This is really, really different to anything I've experienced before. So it's cut to me on the inside now. Well, this is an unusual feeling, boys and girls. We are... <laughs> we are now amphibious. I've got to close all windows because um, when they put the pressure washer on... Oh. So that's open and it's closing. Look at this! <laughs> what a very strange feeling. I think there's one more window. <sighs> These... No, that's open. Oh, that's closed. Right, so, we are now <laughs> no longer in water. Look at that, that's my damn windlass down there. How good is this? What an adventure, <laughs> he says. Let's see where we're going. <laughs> that is Wilf. So yeah, it's not very often I meet someone who can swear as much as I, but Wilf can. So this is where we came yesterday. We've got little bits of anode left.
something we're not able to do very often. Some better nick than I expected. Hmm. As you can see, the basic below the water uh, structure isn't quite as bad as I was expecting, having gone two years longer than ideally, uh, thanks to COVID. Um, I was pushing me luck anyway, and then COVID kicked in. Um, I'd sort of like been tempted with the idea of using the two pack on there, but uh, a friend of mine put me off, and so I didn't uh, go and have it done. Uh, and so this is the first now opportunity to have a look under the water line if we actually now have a look where the uh, pressure washer super pressure washer gets onto it all of those little rusty sort of patches are completely superficial there's no massive pitting on there at all so i'm happy with that uh not as happy as i would have been if i'd have managed to pull it out a year and a half two years ago but there you are we shall see what it's like. We're also going to paint the red and the white stripes around the back when we're finished. That, boys and girls, is it for today. Hope you enjoyed this. If you have, please feel free to subscribe to the channel. Give us a thumbs up. Give this poor lad a thumbs up as well. Back soon with the before and after. Well, actually, this is the before. Back soon with the after. <laughs>